Hello everybody, this is the Omega PC Gamer Omega Gym. As you can see, this is my desktop. As you can see, I'm also very happy about MapleStory 2. Anyways, I'm not here to talk about MapleStory 2. Let's check out this thing. You see Ironside right here? Yeah, we're gonna fix that icon. Like, this doesn't break your game. This just doesn't do anything to the game. It's just that it bothers me. When I see an, a broken icon like this, it bothers me. Now I could tell Ironside to go fix it on their forums, but, uh, but uh, let's let's leave them alone. I'm having this problem with Ironside. I used to have it with the Maple Story uh, icon as well. So this is a little tutorial how to fix broken icons. Yes, let's fix these. Okay, so Ironside, what you want to do is when you see a broken icon like this one, you right click it, you go to properties. You go to change icon. As you can see, see Windows can find the file, the um, area games, Ironside, Ironside that Ico, Ico are the icon. It's an icon image, so it can find it. So what we're gonna do is browse. We're gonna go to okay go to where's my pc okay this pc now i have a uh, different drives here i have a portable drive i have uh, the main drive and i have a solid state drive which is the one that handles windows in any of my editing program that i use so uh, for you it might be c drive for me it's and it's like gonna be on the d drive wherever you install uh, area games or iron side on that's where you're gonna find it I think it's gonna be um uh, program file eighty two. Nope, I mean eighty six. I say eighty two. <laughs> nope, it's not here. Did I install it inside of my main drive? I think I did. Oh no, there it is. There it is. Let's see, area games. Ironside. And then as you can see, right here we have the application. The Ironside setup and the Ironside logo, uh, Ironside launcher. I mean, as you can, and um, that's the uninstall. Normally, like this one has supposedly an icon somewhere that I can look for, but apparently it can't find it for some reason. Give me a go. Nope, not there. Banners. Nope. Data. Nope. Nope. Easy anti cheat clients, launchers, licenses, localization, certificates. So, yeah, it, it cannot find. I don't know, maybe it didn't get installed for me. I don't know if you're having this problem, but this is if your iron side icon is broken. This is what you want to do you go in here and you go to the one that says launch. I think you can pick any of these three as long as it's the iron side logo on it, it doesn't matter the application. I'm just gonna put, pick this one and go open. As you can see, there it is. Just gonna use that as uh, the icon. Go here, and now as soon as we hit apply, it should change. Bam! As you can see, if you don't like that um, window shield thing, I think we can pick the other icon on it, like this one right here, and we can just apply, and it will remove that shield with it. No. Nope. It doesn't, so that shield stays there. So, you know what? I didn't see any game with that shield. I thought it's because I picked the launchers. Let's pick this one. Let's see what it does. Apply. Okay, let's do a refresh. Okay, no. So, yeah, it's always going to have that shield for me. Okay. It's cool. As long as we fix it. As you can see, there we go. I fixed the icon. It's now on my desktop and it's looking better. It used to do that to my Maple Story. So, all you gotta do is look for the file, look for the application, and you should be able to fix it yourself and no problem. That's also how the, the way people do custom icons as well. They just replace them with their own custom icons. So, I hope this tutorial was helpful and hope to see you soon, guys. And this has been Omega Gym. Thank you for watching.